Shalom, when the star of whose souls by giving no praise to Yahweh, by Hashem Yahushua, by Hashem Kodesh, the Beloved is Apostle Great Most and honestly, brothers do the work, the Most on truth, the insincerity. Yahweh is the real name of whom the world ignorantly calls God Jehovah Yahweh. His real name is Yahweh, and son's true name is Yahweh Shai. And when we pray, we pray Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai, Ba meaning in, Ha meaning than Shem meaning name. So Yahweh in the name of Yahweh Shai. It's a great one. Um, inspired uh, thought about this word uh, propaganda. Right, and I kind of wanted to look into it a little bit. Right now, this is the uh, definition commonly known. This is information, ideas, opinions, or images often only given one part of an argument that are broadcast, published, or in some other way spread with the intention of influencing people's opinions. Right, and um, yeah, this came from you know the fact you speak to a lot of people here in 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 Britain, right? Um, and you know they will tell you that you know we have no. Uh, propaganda whatsoever right but then i looked into the etymology of the word right so this is uh propaganda says noun right but listen to this from 1718 a committee of cardinals in charge of foreign missions of the catholic church short for congregatio de propaganda fide right which is congregation for propagating the faith right now uh, you know, this, 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 I found like rather intriguing because, you know, on the right hand side, you know, that's, you know, what the, you know, starting off, you know, the puzzles on down, that's what we do, right? But, you know, not, not to, 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 uh, you know, try and gather anyone and everyone, right? Like what you see the church is doing up because we understand that this is a thing about the elect. However, we are still commanded to go out and teach and, you know, uh, prophesy unto the nations, right? You know, and, uh, you know, the Israelites, the elect of Israel, right, will hear and the Lord will wake them up, right? Um, whereas the, the, the heathens, they're just hearing their judgment, right? And the things are to come for them, right? As it says in Jeremiah 28 and 8, we can grab it real quick. It says, the prophets that have been before me and before thee of all prophesied both against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence so that's what whenever you see the uh, prophets coming back on the scene that's what it is that they you know that, that they're here to do right um however i did uh, also think of this word or uh, in, from the perspective of the left hand side right i.e how you know you have this uh you know you have this devil right that's you know, basically pushes propaganda upon the people gets people to you know fall into basically fall into temptation right? and ultimately who's his main target jake right because esau wants uh, you know as a whole he wants total control of everyone but he wants to get rid of jake right he wants to accuse us right uh, to yahweh shim yahweh shai right so it's revelation 12 and 10 says and i heard a loud voice saying in heaven now comes salvation and strength and the kingdom of our power the power of his anointed Right, for the accuser of our brethren is cast down, right, which accused them before our our power day and night, right. So East was basically pushing out, you know, different uh, doctrines, right, different ideologies for the people to uh, swallow, right, to for the for 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 for, for Jake to eat and to um you know to, uh, to 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 basically fall into, right, to basically fall into the ways of Esau. Right, because he knows that that for us is death, right? He un he understands that when Jake do right, right, that we're good. So this is Jude five from seventeen, right? He says, and while they sinned not before their God, they prospered because the God, uh, because the Most High that hated iniquity was with them. But when they departed from the way which He appointed them, they were destroyed in many battles very sore. And they were led captives into a land that was not theirs, and the temple of their god was cast down uh, to the ground, and their cities were taken by the enemies. Right? And Esau knows this history. Right? He knows that when Jay goes off, when we as a nation go off, right, the Lord don't deal with us. So once again, that's why he pushes these doctrines on us. Right? You know, he's a uh, you know proper you know his congregation as a council. Right? As we're saying on that, there's you know this on the left hand side, right, and then there's this on the right hand side. Right, he also has his congregation, his secret councils. Right, it was said in Psalm sixty-four. Right, having from the secret council, 
right? Protect me from the secret council, right? But you know what? What's one of these things that these Esau secret councils are doing, right? They're propagating, but not faith. But the, you know, the, they're propagating, um, you know, their doctrines, right? In the background, okay. So we're gonna get a few precepts. Uh, you know, close it out. Right, it says uh, Psalms thirty six and three, starting off with the left hand side. Right, it says the words of his mouth are iniquity and de and deceit. He hath left off to be wise and to do good. Right, and you know there are two precepts that come off of this, which we're gonna read in a sec. Right, but the words of his mouth are iniquity and deceit. Right, that, that what comes out of his mouth, what what he speaks, right, is is wickedness and deceit. So when he's telling you know people are oh, did this that or the other, right? He, that's why we we filter everything out through the scriptures that this you know that this man says, right? Because he's got the rest of the world thinking that he's the um, arbiter of truth, right? Whereas that's not that's not true, right? It's, you know, or, or, or on earth starting off with the apostles on down, we're the ones that say what's going on, right? And but 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 not of ourselves, right? Because the Lord is the one that has opened us, opened our eyes to this, or opened our eyes to, you know, to, to, to these scriptures, right? You know, and then we know what it is that we need to know for these times, which is we see through a glass darkly, right? But the, the point here that I want to get is the words of his mouth are iniquity and deceit, right? So when he's speaking things, whether it be in the news, whether it be in advertising, like because, for instance, when I was preparing the lesson, looked into one article which speaks about the seven uh, forms of propaganda, right? Which is basically just like almost social engineering, if you will. Okay, when this man is speaking, yeah, you take, what does it say in so at the 12th chapter? Take good heed right? and beware of him, right? Um, yes, like I said, there were two precepts that come off of the back of that one, right? So Psalms 58 and 3, the wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking lies. Their poison is the poison of a serpent. They are like the deaf adder that stoppeth her ear. Okay, so when when this man um uh, speaks, man, he's he, he's speaking lies. Right, you read what Yahweh Shai said in um uh, John. Was it John eight? Oh, escapes me where that is now. John eight forty eight, thirty eight. But basically, when we eight John eight forty four, right when Yahweh Shai says, "Ye are your father the devil." Right, speaking to wicked Israelites, man. But what does Yahweh Shai say in that? Right, he says he was a murderer. So he was a murderer from the beginning and abode not in truth. Okay, so basically anything that this man says, right, is nothing but a lie. Okay, um, and the next one, of course, Psalms five twenty one. The words of his mouth were smoother than butter, but war was in his heart. His words were softer than oil, yet were they drawn swords. Right, and that's the whole point of. Uh, you know, propaganda in the you know in the commonly understood context, right? To basically say certain things, but really there is a there is a deeper agenda, and you know, right now you see what hap what's happening between you know uh, you know Russia, Ukraine, and the Western world. Okay, you're basically seeing you know d d different articles, basically saying you know one 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 side is is is, is saying certain things. You know, to make them look like the good guys, but at the same time, they're killing a whole bunch of people, and vice versa. Okay, right? Um, but there was another point that I was gonna make that, but it escapes me. But yeah, I mean, you know, that's that's this man, uh, just in general, right? And just to close off on the left hand side, Habakkuk two fifteen, woe unto him that giveth his neighbor drink, right? And that drink is philosophies, right? And East will be what? Propagating, right? You know, I never actually finished def this definition, but East will be propagating, right, his different ideologies onto the people. Right? So like I said, I, I, I never actually finished this definition. Right, so it says uh, propaganda now. 1718, Committee of Cardinals in charge of foreign missions of the Catholic Church, short for Congregatio de Propaganda Fide, Congregation for Propagating the Faith. A committee of cardinals established in 1622 by Gregory the 15th is likely to supervise foreign missions. The word proper, the word is properly the ablative feminine gerundive of Latin propagare, set forward, extend, spread, increase. Right, hence any movement or organization to propagate some practice or ideology. Right, from 1790. 
right, the modern political sense, dissemination of information, tends to promote a political point of view, dates from World War One, not originally pejorative and implying bias or deliberately misleading. So originally it wasn't, right, just like how you see it up here. It just means to propagate, right, a point of view, basically, right? You know, any movement or organisation propagates some practice or ideology. Um, so it says, meaning material or information propagated to advance a cause, etc., is nine, from 1929, right? Um, so where were we? Right, so back up, Coot 215, warned him that give with his neighbour drink, right? So do, we don't want him that, uh, you know, propagates, you know, uh, um, uh, a wicked philosophies unto his neighbour, okay? And, you know, what represents destruction? The Mosai is going to destroy this devil, regardless of, you know, what propaganda he tells you, right? Which his propaganda is, is Psalms 49 and 11, right? That his house is going to continue forever, but it ain't going to continue. Right, he, he, the scripture says in Job, right, that you know the Most High set up his bounds that he cannot pass. Right, it says that makes them drunken also, that thou mayst look on their nakedness. Right, but once again, going back into this definition, complication for the propagation, for for propagating the faith. Right, on the right hand side this time. Right, it says Matthew ten and five. These twelve, Yahweh shall sent forth and commanded them, saying, Go. Not into the way of the Gentiles and into any city of the Samaritans and to you not. Right? It says, uh, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel, and as you go, preach, saying, The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Right? So that's what we've been commanded to do to go out and teach. Right? Do the spirit and power of Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, it's the honor of the apostle and down. That's what we do. Right? That is the standard that we have been set. Okay? You know, until, you know, to do these shows, uh, you know, during the week as well. Right, but that 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 is that is our duty to go on and teach, right? To propagate the faith, right? Uh, what was that one? The apostles at? This is Hebrews um uh, three thirteen, right? But exhort one another daily, while it, while it is called today, lest any of you be hardened throughout the deceitfulness of sin, right? So we've got to be propagating this, you know, to this uh, truth as, as often as we can, man. Right? This faith, we've got to be propagating as often as we can. Okay? Right? Um, next one, Luke 14, 23 says, And the Lord said unto that servant, unto the servant, Go out into the highways and hedges and, co uh, and compel them to come in that my house may be filled. Right? And that's like, an, you know, an allegory for this truth. Right, to go out there into the highways and, 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 and byways, right, to prophesy instant in season, out of season, as we're about to also read. Right? And once again, those whom the Lord wants to, uh, who, those whose ears the Lord wants to open, they'll be open. Right? But we still have to go out there, even if, you know, no one comes in. Right? You know, rather, even if it appears that no one's coming in. Okay? But there's going to come a time when, you know, the, these these floodgates are going to open. Second Timothy 4 and 2, as promised, right? Preach the word, be instant, in season, and out of season, reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine, right? So no matter the weather, obviously not not, not, not to be over-righteous, <laughs> okay? Right, but it, it, no matter the weather, we've got to be out there, Right? Uh, Mark sixteen fifteen it says, and he said unto them, Go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. And what's really helped, right? You know, this truth go global, right? Is this is this is is, is this internet? But let me actually look into this word here, well, because yeah, the feeling it would be cosmos, right? Which basically goes into um, a, a particular sect, right? I.e. Israel. Right? So go go through Israel, right? But even then, you know, Israel scattered all over the world. Right, and preaches gospel to 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 to, to wherever a, a Jake is, and like I said at the top of the lesson, also, right, these heathens need to know their judgment too, right. We need to propagate that information unto them, right. As Luke four eighteen, uh, the spirit of the Lord is upon me because He hath anointed me, right, to preach the gospel to the poor, right. He hath sent me to heal the brokenhearted, to preach deliverance to the captives, and recovering of sight to the blind. To set at liberty them that are bruised, okay, and that's what it is. The spirit of the Lord is 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 on us to do this, to propagate this truth, 
right? You know, to set out this propaganda. <laughs> okay. All right. You know that that's that's what we have been. Uh, you know, if we if we you know if we be of the elect, that's what we have been uh, chosen to do. Right. You know, certainly been called to do it. Okay, and this is um, quoting Isaiah sixty one and one. Okay, so final one, Matthew twenty four fourteen, and this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for witness unto all nations, and then shall the end come. And I wanted this to be the last precept, just to you know really hammer on that you know hey we 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 can't get out of this man's kingdom right up until. You know this. You know this. 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 This truth is you know propagated throughout the four corners of the world, right? And the elect are sealed, and that's what you're seeing happening before your eyes, mm. right? Because the elect, you know, is being sealed, right? This truth is being you know preached throughout the four corners of the earth, all right? You know, the, you you have Israelites finding out they're Israelites. You know, I know, I believe, uh, a, a number of, you know, um. Uh, uh, elders Archim, right? Um, uh, basically, well, you know, were stationed in you know different countries, right? Uh, uh, you know, just listening to this truth, and I was like, oh man! As soon as they came back, you know, they 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 left the army and stuff like that, right? But that's because this the Lord has allowed this truth to be global, to be propagated, okay? So as always, Lord's will that was edifying. Until the next time, we say Shalom.